Well, California is flush with cash. Mm -hmm. How about that? And that could mean a nice payday for you. That's right. After dire predictions a year ago about our state's financial health amid the coronavirus pandemic, Governor Newsom says California has a $75 billion budget surplus. Well, KCAL 9 political reporter Tom Wade is here now with more on the fiscal turnaround and what Governor Newsom wants to do with that surplus money. He wants to give it away <laughs> to a lot of people, but it is a surprise, this surplus that we have. So if you make less than $75,000 a year, you're likely to get a stimulus check if state lawmakers approve the governor's plan, which they are expected to do. Newsom says this is the best way to continue to rebuild the state's economy, but his recall opponents say this is just a publicity stunt. I'm about to make an announcement no other governor in California history has ever made. Governor Gavin Newsom Americans. revealed California has one of the biggest budget surpluses in state history, despite gloomy predictions a year ago that the pandemic would destroy the state's economy. And Newsom says he wants to give billions back to the middle class and poor families. Today we're announcing a $75.7 billion budget surplus. That tax rebate will impact just shy of 80% of all tax filers will get a direct stimulus check. Here's who's eligible for this new round of stimulus money. $600 direct payments will go to taxpayers, making up to $75,000 a year. Families with kids get an extra $500. Undocumented families are also eligible to receive $500 payments. And there's rent and utility help as well. $5 billion has been set aside for rental assistance, and $2 billion has been set aside for overdue utility bills. Just a struggle day by day. Kimberly Cunningham of Los Angeles was a flight attendant who was laid off at the beginning of the pandemic. She says a new round of stimulus is desperately needed. Even the ones who are making 100K, I think every family deserves that stimulus check. Times is hard. They have mortgages, families to take care of, you know. Everyone needs it. This is the second round of stimulus payments from the state since the outset of the pandemic, but the first checks only went to people making less than $30,000 a year. Newsom's recall opponents pounced on the announcement. Republican John Cox said today it was just a ploy to score votes. We're gushing revenue. Isn't that great? The, the governor's got a lot of money to hand out, and of course, he's worried about his own neck in terms of his political ambition, and, and, and that's why you know he's talking about this now uh, the taxpayers that's the taxpayers money frankly california has the highest taxes in the country the state is flush with money professor of political science fernando garris says states across the country also have surpluses it's just that california has even more money and it's up to the governor how to give it back in some part this is not state money it's federal money given through the states and it is the job of the state, the governor, to figure out how to do it. And every governor right now is in this situation, and one can't say one way is better than the other. So is he using it, and it might help him politically? Probably, but he's still doing what is required by the federal regulations that are being given out with this money. The reason for California's surplus? The state's richest saw their wealth surge during the pandemic, thanks to stocks, and the state collected billions more than expected in capital gains taxes. Some economists worry, though, that the stimulus payments are too much and that people may not look for work. I'm not sure what that does for our economy. If anything, it's going to make it more miserable for our small business owners who are relying very heavily on the minimum wage workers to come back and these workers are not showing up. But struggling Californians say it's money they need. Well, it would help me out enormously. I'd be at like a down payment for uh, to slide my way into an apartment. It will help me, you know, with rent, you know, with, um, you know, uh, electricity, you know, things like that. Just, you know, everyday life. The cost of living in California is just like ridiculous. Calvin Falconer, the Republican former mayor of San Diego, who's also running in the recall election, said in a statement, California needs permanent real, real tax relief, not just one-time stimulus checks.